So most people, uh, you know, they think fireplaces from back in the day were used, you know, you use regular just firewood or whatever, but if you look at these old structures and you're familiar with Tartarian technology, you'll understand that these things were powered using some type of alternative energy source. As you can tell here, uh, I don't think that these fireplaces were built using, uh, you know, materials from a horse and buggy. As you can tell that many things in our history have been changed uh, extensively if you have the eyes to see, which we all do, but most people just don't like to you know, take that extra step and uh, realize what they're really looking at, such as this picture here. If you didn't know, I actually do electrical work full time at my uh, you know, regular paying uh, globe quote unquote slave job and this would be called a voltage regulator from you know 18 1700 something along those lines and then we have here a vimana a flying chariot in ancient india hmm fascinating you know these uh ancient technologies look so you know superiorly advanced than anything that we have in the modern day Modern aviation likes to think that the airplane was created in the early 1900s, especially for the modern turbine engine. But what we have here is imagery you know, showing that we have this type of technology far before uh, any modern aircraft. My wife sent me this image earlier today, and I have a couple more in this slide, but uh, you guys tell me what you think this is, you know, modern uh, spirit uh, device of, you know, talking to dead relatives or maybe some type of holographic technology. Most people might write this image off as some kind of CGI or something else, com you know, entirely. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what I'm looking at here. It's uh, pretty fascinating. Communication with the dead or a hoax? Hmm. Many people would like to write these subjects off as some type of hoax or logical fallacy, but what do the images tell you? Looks about Tartarian to me. As we all know, the inverse square law of light has been used for, you know, several uh, years. I won't even say, you know, hundreds or thousands because we know how history has been so, for the ones that do know, so, uh, you know, taken from us. But uh, here we have an image of Devil Fountain, which would be, you know, used in a very esoteric fashion to describe how light works. Hmm, interesting. Nephilim or just a really big guy? I'll let you make the